so it's not the weekend yet but i just wanted to share a little bit of my first day at my new job i'm on my way you know i'm looking very scholarly i got my iced coffee that i made it was bomb oh And I must say, I took my time on these eyebrows today, honey. Took my time. I gotta run in and get some more stuff out of the house real quick to take with me. I'm trying to prep. I was supposed to be prepping all last weekend for um for the room, but I didn't get to do none of that because obviously we was just having fun this weekend, so. Yeah. I'm free. Don't grieve for me, for now I'm free. I'm following the path God laid for me. I took his hand when I heard him call. I turned my back and left it all. I could not stay another day to laugh, to love, to work, or play. Tasks left undone must stay that way. I found that peace at the close of day. If my pardon has left a void, then fill it with a remembered joy. A friendship shared, a laugh, a kiss. Ah, yes, these things I too will miss. Be not burdened with times of sorrow. I wish for you the sunshine of tomorrow. My life's been full, I've savored much. Good friends, good times, my loved ones touch. If my time seemed all too brief, don't lengthen it now with undue grief. Lift up your heart, rejoice with me. God wanted me now, he sent me free. Amen. 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 Thank you. I guess I can. Was not gonna vlog today, or this weekend. Yeah. But I'm doing it anyway, because I'm standing in the very building that I was born in. <laughs> yeah. I was literally, Literally, you're welcome. Born and raised right here in this building. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow. You're welcome. I know all these services, right? Wow. <laughs> They're like the door, the door women now. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, oh her father. Well, I used to live in this section on the opposite. Elevator. I'm set. I ain't been. Um, hey, please. I ain't been in this building in years. <laughs> I'm going upstairs to where I used to live. It's late, so I can't. My mom actually knows the person that lives there now, but it's late. I'm not gonna wait no door up. I just wanna see. Bell toys, you know how you always get a toy with the kids' meal, and she will always bring them home to me every day. The memories, the fifth floor, bro, man from the fifth floor. slumber parties happened in that house. So many water fights. All our friends coming over. Ah, good, good memories there. Good memories. Alright, so this is going to be the vlog for this weekend. Um, Didn't do much. This weekend has just been consumed of with getting rest, um, grieving, and um, preparing for my classroom and 
editing videos so not much going on here um i just i wasn't even gonna do a vlog to be honest this weekend but um i do have to be consistent is that the word i have to be consistent with putting out okay videos um if I want to make something of myself on here. So I have to continue. Um, and you know, some people would say, you know, take that time. You know, sometimes you need to be in the right state of mind. You know, it's not all about doing this. But, you know, I'm not in that bad of a headspace where I just can't function and can't do a video. I just didn't feel up to it. Um, like I said, so many people that I know has passed away these past couple days. Like three, three people that I know has passed away to be exactly all within a week of each other. And it's been um, shocking, it's been overwhelming. It's been like really, really sad, you know. And always the cliche of just, you know, just shows you life, you just never know. You just never know. And all of these people were not elderly, you know, they were still pretty young, like my parents' age and stuff. So it's like, it's, it's difficult. And as always, my heart and my condolences go out to all of the families affected. Um... You know, I was spending the whole week um, working on an obituary, which is something I've never done before. Um, but writing it was just like, you know, outside the fact that I was exhausted <laughs> because I got to be up at the butt crack of dawn now with this new job. Um, and then I would come home and then work on it. And it was just like, you know, there's no time to waste. You know, there's no time to just sit around and waste your life because you don't know when it's your time and you know writing it you it made me think like what is someone going to say in your obituary you know at least for me like I want something meaningful in that obituary if I could write my own <laughs> I would write my own but you know live your life leave an impression, leave your mark, leave your memories, because that's all everyone's going to have once you're no longer here. So it's just been a lot. Um, I've just been going through a lot, but I'm pushing through, like, you know, yet another bump in the road um, popped up this week outside of losing people, you know, and I'm just like, oh, here we go again. Another bump to the head. And usually something like this would break me down, have me crying, hysterical, going through the motions. But I didn't cry. I dealt with it and it was just like, okay, I know what I did wrong. I know where I messed up at. I know what I got to do going forward. And... I just kept pushing. I kept pushing because I've learned to stop stressing things knowing that the good Lord above is going to handle it. <laughs> you understand? So I learned to just let go and let God honestly. You know, it's like a lot. It's just a lot happening all within a week. I'm trying to readjust to a new environment, to a new work environment, a new way of doing things, being the new girl, all of this stuff I'm not used to. So it's 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 a it's a whole adjustment period for me right now. And like I said, I was like, I ain't doing no video. Like I gotta just do me. But my numbers are growing. And I don't want that to stop. Because I'm doing this for a purpose, for a reason. And I told y'all, I'm standing in my purpose now. So if I stop, even if for a week, to not do a video because I'm 
in my feelings or whatever the case. The way these things are set up, you got to be consistent. They got to see that you up on here every week, two, three times a week. So I got to do what I got to do because I'm going to be all right. 